Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking about a good old, I'm saying my good old friend, it's not my friend. Um, Talk about <laughs> Britney Spears. Everybody, um, I don't know if you're familiar with the Free Britney movement that has been going on for the past couple of years, but we'll get into why a little bit later in this video. So recently a report came out and said she was under investigation for allegedly striking the employee doing a dispute at home um they basically said i think she her and i think it was it the chef um was it the chef i think it was the chef no the housekeeper yeah so they basically said that Brittany. Uh, and the housekeeper had gotten into it. The housekeeper claimed that Brittany allegedly uh, was holding her phone and Brittany tried to knock it out of her hand. Um, I mean, I don't even... Th this story is just so... Like, so, like... Okay, she knocked the phone out your hand. That don't mean she hit you. Like, she she hit the phone if she knocked the phone out your hand. But anyway... It said that they got into it because um, the housekeeper um, allegedly took Britney Spears' dog to the veterinarian and they got into it about her dog, right? So all of that happened because of that reason, allegedly, which that it it's just so, like, y'all caused the both, like, I don't know, but... So that's what they said that allegedly happened. Now, Britney Spears has been in the media a lot lately, or the news a lot lately, because of her conservatorship that she have, um, that she was under for the last, I don't know how many years, for forever, seemed like. And her dad was over it, so she, it was basically like Britney felt, they were saying that Britney allegedly felt like, she was a hostage. She couldn't spend her own money. Basically, her dad governed her life, told her what she could and could not do. So, here recently, her daddy stepped down from that. And, you know, <coughs> excuse me, Brittany was happy uh, that he stepped down. And, oh, it's been 13 years since she'd been under it. I knew it had been a long time. Um, so, yeah, she was very excited about her father stepping down. Now... According to reports, they don't know exactly when, uh, like, she's going to start being on her own. Like, I don't know when that stepping down actually go into place, but it's not like an instant thing. Like, oh, he agreed to step down, then tomorrow I'm free. Apparently, that's not how it is. Um, she has also been in the news because she has been getting into it with her sister as well. Huh? Her sister had a back and forth on Instagram about some things that... Of course, Britney did not like. Now, we remember the last time that Britney Spears was, you know, trying to stand up for herself and, you know, speak out against certain things. Remember, that is when the media tried to portray her like she was this alleged crazy person. When she cut her hair, everybody was like, look at Britney, she's crazy. Like the same way they tried to do Kanye, or they did do Kanye. Like, as soon as people start speaking out against things and, you know, standing their ground and going against the grain, they try to present them in this crazy manner, like, every single time. So I'm curious to know, do you guys think the media is trying to put these stories out because they know that um, Britney is no longer going to be under her conservatorship that she has been under for the last 13 years? And is it because of that they're, like, do y'all think they're going to start painting a picture of her being kind of like the same way 13 years ago, trying to make it justifiable as to why she should still, like, she should stay under her conservatorship? Some things I did not put in this video is ever since her dad agreed to step down on her Instagram, if you go to it, she have a lot of topless photos and a lot of her fans was in the comments and they were concerned about that saying like this is unlike Britney um basically saying is it Britney posting these photos and they're trying to say that the 
that Britney, they're saying that Britney Spears allegedly said that the photos is representation of her being free, but it is so many of them, and I didn't want to put them in this video. She is covering her, her um, areola, but I mean, don't nobody want to see that. But when I saw that on her Instagram, I was like, why is it so many? I know it's over five. And I'm like, I can see maybe you doing it once, but doing it continuously, I feel like it was lining up with the, oh, I'm wild, Brittany. I'm, you know, I shaved my hair, Brittany. You know, I just felt like that's the way that that was leading. I hope that's not the case, but comment down below. Tell me what you guys think about that. Um... I was going to say something else. Oh, and then it came out that the reason why she cut her hair is because um, she said she was tired of people being in her head all the time. And that's why she wanted to cut her hair. But um, I have been around a lot of people who have shaved their head, like went down to a low cut. A female that did it, and um, they did it when they, I guess, feel liberated and feel like they're starting over. And they just want to, you know, fresh, new, like... I don't know. They said it make them feel like it's like they're cutting the weight off their shoulders and they just feel like like they're having a new life. So that could be the same thing that Brittany um, wanted. But the media portray her to be like, oh, she's crazy, et cetera, et cetera. So comment down below. Do you think this is the same propaganda that they're going to use th like they used 13 years ago? Or do you think it's going to be different? I don't know. That's all I got to say about it, and I'm out.